mean, I, you know, I remember I used to go out and go up into cafes and even at that stage, say before um, Sorcerer's Apprentice, I'd go into pubs and just walk up to random people and do tricks on them and, and, and it would always be a, the, the more I'd push myself and the better I'd sort of feel after doing it and it was just about trying to practice and get my hours in and get used to being in different situations and that kind of stuff. So yeah, I really hit the ground running in that way. Um, but then, I mean, to be fair, but I think probably most people feel this, they always feel slightly like they're out of their depth and you know, just kind of hanging on. I don't think that changes, though. I think uh, we, we were talking about this before before we, we started the podcast, that idea of worrying about the show that you're doing, the, the effects that you're doing, putting the, the, the plan together. And even now, 14, 13, 14 years later, with all the experience under your belt, and you've got a lot of experience, you're still questioning yourself. Yeah. I mean, all the time. And I'm, and I'm constantly thinking, I mean, this sounds awful, but do I want, this is what I want to do? And, I'm, and, I, and I constantly feel like a, say a bit of a phony. It depends what mood I'm in, but I can definitely feel like I'm just, I don't have enough material. Like I'm, uh, you know, I'm about to do a stage show and it's like, yeah, you know, I just, I just feel like I'm just never prepared enough, or it's never. And also, what we were talking about earlier is that it's never you're never fully satisfied with what you're doing. Like by the time you get get there and you're performing it, you're like, mm, it's not really good enough, and then you suddenly set your sights somewhere else. So it's kind of always chasing that feeling like you're you're good enough, or you're, you've reached that arrived at your destination. Yeah, it's tough. It's a tough, but that's the. I think that's the curse of being a performer. I don't think it's. I don't think it's um, particular to magic. I think it's the same with acting. I yeah. It's the same with any performance with an audience. Yeah. No, I think you're probably right. So it's just something that... But it's. I think it's. it can be a struggle because it, it, you can sort of get those highs and lows. And if a show goes well, then you're kind of... You're flying and you just feel so good and so confident, but it, it goes badly. You're just like, I knew it. Like, I'm just... I don't know enough and I'm you know, not prepared enough and can I go through all of that again? 